Hi, this is Kumaran. In this video, we will discuss about uh, uh, Kale software for 8051 microcontroller. So, the microcontroller program we can type here and execute to uh, get the output as uh, same as uh, what the controller uh, IC will do. Okay, let's uh, go for the installation and uh, execute the program here. So, this is the uh, product from the ARM, the application file. You can download it uh, from the ARM website, otherwise you can get it from my uh, description of this uh, video also. Just double click this, it will ask uh, to modify, yes, give the next agreement uh, for the license, and click next. Now you type your uh, first name, everything you have to type. Then your company name, any company name you type, then email also you type. You have name and uh, name everything and click next, it will install. So after the installation it will uh, the software you can get an icon in the desktop you can execute in this so in this uh, video we will discuss a program of uh, addition of numbers multiplication division any arithmetic or logic operation we can perform okay we can uh, finish this so now uh, the software is being uh, installed we will check the desktop we have a KLU vision 5 double click that it's a from arm so ARM uh, advanced description company is developed here it will support for uh, arm also for that another software is there you can download it so go to the project open a new micro UV vision project so you can give any name of your project within a folder you have because uh, many files will be generated while uh, compiling the program so for example i am going with uh, mul so the it will ask that which device here many devices are there you can select the intel device because the 8051 microcontroller is from intel double click that uh, plus symbol here uh, the 80 for intel itself lot of devices are there so we'll go with 8051AH. So verify here 8 bit microcontroller, 32 IO lines, 2 timer counter, 5 interrupts, a 4 KB program memory, 128 RAM. So this is our IC8051, what we have learned in theory. The same thing we will uh, implement and execute the program. Okay, click OK. It will ask the startup code uh, to be added in the project. Click yes. Because we need this okay so in this go through uh, there is a startup code in this so now we will go uh, type the program in the file new file type your program for example we will go with uh, division of two 8 bit numbers so we will take uh, two numbers uh, move a comma the hash symbol here we are using immediate addressing hash uh, 5 2 H. Then we will take a move B register hash zero three H. So for simplicity, we will take a smaller number. For example, uh, one three. So one three by three. That's what our task. We will uh, divide directly, divide uh, space AB. Here divide AB instruction itself, right? Now the answer is in quotient in A register, a reminder in uh, B register, that to be loaded on the external memory. So for that, we have to initialize DPTR with the corresponding address. Move DPTR, comma, ash, the corresponding address. For example, uh, 4200 address I am using. So now copy the one data from accumulator to this move, x, x refer external memory, 
at DPTR means the corresponding address from the register A. That's what. This is not case sensitive. You can you say that caps are small. Now we have to uh, store the reminder also. For that, I increment the DPTR to point the next memory address. DPTR. Then uh, take data to A register. Then only you can copy. So move A comma B because directly from B register you cannot copy to uh, external memory. Move X at the DPTR comma A. So that's it our program is over but uh, microcontroller we don't have any instruction to terminate like halt so for that we are going to use uh, uh, another trick called a short jump sjmp short jump uh, here the label i'm typing on the same instruction so the controller will not fetch further it will stop from the current location that's what so this is the program for uh, division of two 8 bit numbers so 130 by 3 answer what you will get you guess while executing you will verify so store the uh, save the program while saving the program you use the same folder where you have the for project the file name you give that uh, divide uh, dot asm you type because it's assembly language you can in this software you can execute C program also so in that case you have to type dot C but here it is dot ASM so now after that the keywords are enabled here data's are in uh, red color registers are in green color likewise it will uh, enable ok and now we have to add this right click the source group add existing file to the group here you will get that uh, div or enable add this ok now our ism is added there now we have to compile this you check uh, uh, translate here if you have any error warnings yeah, warning is there but uh, no error compile here if it is error means we will uh, we have to clear that error but here it is no error so uh, after this all uh, uh, build and rebuild ok so now the program is compiled no error now go to the debug start debug it will give a 1d indication because it's evolution mode the program size maximum 2k for educational purpose 2k is more than enough so it's enough uh, click ok it will open uh, the execution window the internal registers ab stack pointer uh, then dptr program counter psw uh, registers r not or 7 all are available here then uh, go to the view take a memory window take a memory window 2 so in that memory window we have to get the address so here address is 4200 so the first letter is uh, capital x because it's external memory to indicate then uh, semicolon uh, 0 0 x is indicating hexadecimal 4200 enter so now we will get the memory address 4200 here ok this is external memory and uh, 0 x for hexadecimal 4200 is the memory address so here we have to get the output 13 by 3 what output you will get so let us uh, compile so this is one by one it will execute this is continuous run let us take uh, one by one and execute the first one is accumulator to be loaded that 13h ok so 13 loaded in accumulator next one is b register to be 03 check uh, 03 is loaded here now we will divide both divide a and b see you will get the answer quotient 6 uh, remainder uh, 1 so 13 by 3 6 and 1 how yeah, let us complete the program and uh, give the explanation for that. So now we uh, load the DPTR with the corresponding address. DPTR is 00 now. Load that with the 4200. Now you take the quotient uh, 06 to the first memory address. Check the care 06. It is already executed it seems. 06 loaded. The next memory address increment DPTR to 4201. Now load the reminder. 01 is uh, 
लोडेड या जीरो वन इज लोडेड किया तो शॉर्ट चैन सो हाउ दैट सिक्स आंसर वन थर्टीन बाई वन थ्री only it is uh, three table means four three are twelve remainder one but here it one three is not a decimal whatever uh, as a human we are calculating everything in decimal number system we are using microprocessor using uh, binary number system in terms of hexadecimal so one three means it is not uh, one three it is uh, uh, one into sixteen plus uh, three so it is nineteen by three so nineteen by three in decimal uh, six threes are eighteen remainder one that's how the answer is uh, differs here so always we have to look for the answer from uh, hexadecimal not the decimal answer so likewise you can type all the programs here and uh, get the output uh, get the result if you want all the programs to be executed or uh, you want all the programs logics uh, you comment on this video we will uh, discuss all the programs in the uh, forthcoming videos thank you for watching